Pretty darn nice this morning. Yes, it is. A little uh, virga in some of the clouds. That's when the clouds try to rain in the desert sun and dry air sucks all the moisture out before it can get to the ground. Oh, Tricky opening this tailgate. You got to kind of bump it and pull it. It's a good old truck though. Dry washing this morning. Yep. Hey, I'm hoping to get my hands on that new detector here in the next week or so. Still hoping. <laughs> yeah. Today's June 1st or 2nd. I think it's the 2nd. It's nice being retired sometimes. But I'm gonna do a little dry washing today in the beautiful Arizona desert. It's uh being June, it gets hot pretty quick now. It's going to be 100 and something today. So, fellers got to be very careful out here when it's that hot. Yep, you got to dress for it. Um, this shirt, I think, has a it's 50 on the skin protection. And I got baggy pants on to keep the air moving. I even have a hydration vest I got in the truck there. I may use later if it gets too hot. I'm only going to work till probably 10 or 11. I got people coming over, so I'm going to get this thing set up and we're going to see if we can't get a little gold today, my friends. Just look at these clouds. Yeah, we got the moon still up here, too. Isn't that cool? And the sun's going to come up right over here. Very nice. Just uh, another beautiful morning in the Arizona desert. Anyway, I'm going to get at it. Well, by golly, I had some help show up today. <sighs> Glasses are full of dust. Um, bricks here, and here's where we're digging. Like I told you, we go right down to this bedrock. You can see it down there. The gray looking stuff at the bottom is a uh, volcanic tuff. And it has caliche on top of it that we peel off, and we take the top layer of material off. That's why you don't see us vacuuming. I get so many questions about that, and there's really no reason to vacuum here. The top layer comes right up, and you can see we're working right in somebody's old tailings here. This is all old tailings. We want a coarse header pile here, big one, fine tailings, coarse header piles mixed in. And they were missing a lot of gold. And we're getting it. We just got done looking in our uh, first run for the day. <clears throat> I guess we ran about an hour and a half. And we got some really nice chunky gold in there. There's a big tailings pile there. And this is ours. And we fill our holes as we go. So there was a big hole there when I started. We've got it mostly filled in. These are all somebody else's tailings, as are those down there. So that's what we're doing here. We're just running old tailings. And some places that can be productive. It's all about testing the dirt. You test the dirt. If it's got a good color in it, you run it and see what you get. A lot of people walk right by these old tailings like this, and those old timers may not have been good at what they were doing. They may have had a crappy machine. They may have been totally new at it. Dirt could have been a thousand reasons they were missing gold, or they were just getting so much they didn't care. But anyway, we're getting some nice gold. I'm going to take a break. We'll be back. Well, we're still just chugging along out here. Just took my break, and I'll get back over there and that's some more beautiful Arizona dirt. It's funny because over here there's some virgin stuff that hasn't been disturbed. At least not much. 
other people have poked around in here. But uh, you can see the metamorphic rock on top. And apparently this wasn't rich enough for the old timers because they didn't run it. And they got a trash pile up here. We're going to test it. Yeah, we're going to test down in here a little bit. But right now we're in some pretty good stuff, so we're going to keep running these guys as old tailings as long as they keep paying as good as they are. So pretty darn good pay for stuff somebody already ran one time. They must have been getting some pretty incredible gold. So who knows if they're running it wet or just who knows. They sure lost a lot of gold though. We got some nice pickers in this batch. So really wishing it would rain a little bit here in Arizona. We sure need it. It's been terrible. Um, Lake Mead is down over a thousand feet. And uh, we're looking at some water rationing coming up here if we don't get our summer monsoon, but you know, the weather patterns right now aren't looking good for that summer monsoon. We just have to take it as it comes. The desert's been through droughts before. This is a good one this time. I've never seen anything like it, like I keep saying. Pretty amazing. Anyway, I better go back and shovel before I get fired. Whoo, done. Hot. Already down there 100 degrees. We're back at the old poop tube. Wahoo. Gonna run this and we'll show you what we got. Well, <laughs> today was one of those days, wasn't it? Here's our gold. Yay. <laughs> It was a bad day. And a couple nice chunks in there. But uh, we're not going to keep running there. That one spot anyway. Halfway decent goal, but way less than we're used to getting out of there. So you don't always win. That's how it is with gold prospecting. But those little chunks made up for a lot of the finds we didn't get. But, oh well. If you like these videos, like, subscribe, ring the bell. Bird flew over my head. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Next year you're out.